So Jesse has learned something uh, from a plumber in regards to what <laughs> you shouldn't flush down the toilet. Yes. It only took you how many years to learn this, though? Okay, like, I had a good mom, okay? But <laughs> I'm making it sound like I wasn't taught a thing growing up. Uh-huh. And I think I'm going to help people out there with this information. Okay. So this happened before I moved to Kingston. Uh, my toilet was clogged. Had to call a plumber. And he asked me if there was anything unusual I put down the toilet. And I'm not a savage. I'm like, no, I only put things down the toilet that are supposed to go down the toilet, mm-hmm, right? Mm-hmm. So he gets out that big curly thing. What's it called? Snake. snake. <laughs> Thank you. The big curly thing. And he just goes about his work, unclogged it, but he pulls out everything that was clogging my toilet. Uh huh. Which was yes, primarily Q-tips and dental floss. What are you doing flushing those things? <laughs> I thought they, they're they small and, like, bendy. They can be flushed. Doesn't matter. That goes into our, like, septic. That goes out into, like, yeah, that's and it's bad. Not good. Right. And so, bad. So bad, I, Jesse. Bad. Very bad. So he started... Floss la- and Q-tips. Like, <laughs> what? Well, I just... I'm, I've never done it since, but, like, you know... Oh, well, it's only been how long, though, that you actually did it for? Well, listen, there's... He's reformed for a month, everybody. <laughs> Everyone send him a congratulations. He has yeah. not flushed. Freaking... <laughs> <laughs> well, my logic was there uh-huh. are things that come out of the human body that are larger than a Q-tip. <laughs> so I'm so thinking. <laughs> you think it's okay to flush plastic down the toilet? No, I and I, wax. Listen, I never said my IQ was sky high. <laughs> I just I'm are you tr- digesting plastic and wax? No, maybe <laughs> well, wax, m- but yeah, well, I don't like know. not a plastic. Plastic stick? So, no, I, maybe, you know, in my face, but not in my digestive system. So this guy, the plumber starts laughing and he says the best part of his job is when he asks people, what did you flush down the toilet? And everybody says, oh, nothing. And then he pulls out <laughs> makeup wipes. So he was yeah. telling makeup wipes is the worst thing. They don't break down 100%, at all. 100%. Even if it says flushable, they yeah. are usually not flushable. Like, don't do it. So Q-tips and floss. Okay, I'm a bad boy. But the one that kind of surprised me was Kleenex. He said, you're not even supposed to flush Kleenex. Oh, that's interesting. I paper thought- towel, I knew, because it's thick. Yes. But right, Kleenex, you think it's closer to the toilet paper side of things. But no, he said it's because, you know, the minute uh, toilet paper hits water, it starts to disintegrate. It doesn't happen with Kleenex. So it just takes them a bit longer. I think we need to open up the phone line at 507-1043. <laughs> oh, no. Text <sighs> as well. We're talking about it on Facebook. Uh, you know, obviously, there are the things you shouldn't flush down, <clears throat> Jesse. Uh, mm-hmm. But like, what are the weird things that people have flushed down the toilet or like their kids kids do it all the time oh yeah but what are some of your stories because i'm curious do you ever see yeah. that viral video of them pulling a giant boulder of makeup wipes out of the sewer yes it's That's disgusting. Just, it was really gross yes. yeah <laughs> we actually stopped my niece uh, when i was uh back home um for family matter uh, uh-huh. about well two weeks ago she was about to flush a makeup wipe down the toilet oh. and my husband had been walking by the bathroom and stopped in his tracks and he's like don't you dare <laughs> she's yeah. like what he's like don't flush that down the toilet otherwise we're gonna have to go get the snake she's like i don't understand i do it all the time like no (gasps) wonder your toilets are clogged at your house all the time makeup wipes are expensive anyway just use pond's cold cream like our grandma's (laughs) katie perry (laughs) part of me on 104.3 fresh radio